All we want is justice. So whoever the person or persons are, we ask that you turn yourself in. New at 5, the Birmingham Police Department asking for help solving a cold case. And the victim's family is pleading for answers. Welcome in. I'm Jim Dunaway. I'm Sherry Jackson. Their pain is still raw. Two years later, CBS 42 News reporter James McConaughey has their story. And James, this is really still unreal for this family. It is, Sherry. Justin Watford was shot on October 8, 2015. Two years later, his family is still struggling with the loss. It tore us apart. It left a hole in our hearts. <sighs> I'm getting emotional about it now. Justin Watford was a son, a grandson, a brother, and a nephew to the family he left behind. At 22 years old, he was the youngest of his cousins. He always had a bright smile on his face, and he had a boundless love for his family. He was extremely protective of his mother and his sisters. But he was having money problems. He lost a job because he didn't have transportation. So his grandmother told him she would help him buy a car if he could save some money. That was the last time they spoke. He posted on Facebook maybe a couple of days before that his grandma was going to help him buy a car. And later, maybe four or five days later, he was murdered. So instead of me having to purchase a car for my grandson, I ended up purchasing a casket. He came by the house, said he was going, I think, to get something to eat or something, but he never did make it back. According to witnesses, Wadford was sitting in a car outside Good Friends Restaurant on Denison Avenue when he and two other men in the car with him were shot. Investigators want to talk to anyone who has spoken to the two people you see in this video that you'll only see on CBS 42. And if they're watching, investigators want them to come in and give their side of the story. Now, if you have any information that can help this family find answers, contact the Birmingham Police Department or call Crime Stoppers at 254-7777. Live in the newsroom, James McConaughey, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.